Coming up, a high-speed car chase ends in a showdown in the mountains. Brent's attempted to push our patrol car off the cliff. About 9.45 that night, we got a what they call a bolo uh, from Denver PD advising us uh, that he was possibly headed this way. It was nighttime in Glenwood Springs, a mountain town more than 150 miles from Denver. Brents came racing off the highway with police in hot pursuit. Brents suddenly made a sharp U-turn onto a dirt road. The police knew he was trapped. It was a dead end. It was hard to tell what he was going to do when he stopped. We were concerned that he may uh, turn it into a violent confrontation. When Brents realized he couldn't go any further, he lit a cigarette and then put his car in reverse. He slammed into the squad car behind him, pushing it towards the edge of a cliff. Uh, we put our SUV into drive and pushed him back up the hill. And with that, Brents gave up. He surrendered meekly, even apologizing for the trouble he had caused. I was surprised by Brent Brent's appearance. He did not look like a menacing uh, individual. 